Tonight, three children are being treated for gunshot wounds, with two of them in critical condition. Now, each person was hurt in a separate shooting, with the most recent happening on the southeast side after 10 last night, just south of Post Road and U.S. Highway 31. She was taken to Riley in critical condition, with police saying they believe she was shot by accident. Police on the scene also said that this is a dangerous trend forming. Obviously, a lot more people are going out and buying guns these days, but you need to learn how to take care of the weapon as well as how to handle the weapon. Their incidents happened at 3.30 yesterday afternoon, and that teen was taken to Riley in critical condition after being shot on North Tuxedo Street. In that case, a 16-year-old was arrested for a va aggravated battery with the Marion County Prosecutor's Office determining formal charges. Finally, the third shooting took place just before 5 p.m. Friday. An 8-year-old was injured in what police are calling an accidental self-inflicted shooting. This happened on Brenton Street near West 30th and Georgetown Road. Overnight, Mayor Joe Hogsett released a statement that says in part, quote, I share the anger of our community in the proliferation and reckless use of firearms in Indianapolis. He went on to pledge, quote, to continue fighting for common sense on gun safety measures to protect our most vulnerable. And we learned overnight a person died after a shooting yesterday on the northeast side. It happened on Station Street near 30th and Sherman around 9 last night. Police tell us they're working to identify a suspect. IMPD also investigating a different incident after one person was shot and another stabbed on the northeast side. This happened off of Colorado Avenue near 34th Street around 4.30 yesterday evening. At the time, police told us both victims were awake and breathing. IMPD tells us as of this morning, there have been 100 homicides in Indianapolis with 84 of those criminal.